Welcome to the German Wolfpack Revolution. I am the Lord of this world, the German Wolf. And I want in this episode, I want to talk about the paranormal and the and the supernatural and evil and evil stuff. So. Let's start out with the supernatural. I want to say this once, I tell you guys again. This is real. There is evil out in the world. Think about it. You have vampires. You have evil spirits. You have demons. You have ghosts. You have poltergeists. And you have weird creatures wandering the streets in England, France, Paris, Australia, all over the place. I'm going to post a couple links into the description so you guys can understand what I am talking about. Um... Anyways, in my personal opinion about the supernatural, I have experienced it when I was growing up. When I was a teenager, um, like maybe 13 to 14 maybe, I don't know how old I was. I mean, I know how old I was, but anyways, um, like maybe 15. And I was sleeping one night in my former home. And, which I said, I never sleep with my face down on my pillow. One night I go to bed. And it felt like some, it felt like somebody's hand on the back of my head. Right? But the thing, yeah, so, it felt like the, this thing was pushing my head really hard down on my pillow and I and I had a wicked bloody nose and I was sleeping in it. It was disgusting. But the, but the point is it felt like somebody's hand and I heard a voice in my ear telling me that I'm going to, um, um, that I would not be around for all eternity. And that's what I thought I heard. I'm not making this up, guys. This is, this is real. Think about it. Which I said, there's evil out there and you guys don't understand it. I mean, here's a small example. In in New Jersey, there's a, a, a there is a creature. I think it's a demon, a demon or something. I don't know, but the he is called the Jersey Devil. And it and it will like fly around in the in the night sky. But here's a fun fact for you. The inspiration for the Jersey Devil is there's a hockey team called the called the New Jersey Devils. It's it's the I hope you understand where I'm coming from. I mean look look at Satan for example. Satan decides, I mean, um, why would, let's put it this way, why is there a hockey team known as the New Jersey Devils? Key word, devil. You know, like the Jersey Devil. It makes sense, right? That's what I'm saying. You have evil spirits, you have demons, then you have... Um, Frankenstein's monster, 
you know, ghosts, poltergeists, and stuff like that. Um, I have, which I said in my video that, I'm, that I did of last year called The Darkness. Um, some of my movies that I have is based on true events that actually took place. Um, anyways, I will be talking about that, um, in a video this week. Um, if you want to see any more content of, of the, hold on a minute. If you want to see any content about the German Wolfpack Revolution, Hit that notification button so you guys can be informed every time I make a video. Alright. Any, anyways, um, I, oh, yeah, I forgot to mention the reason why I named the series the German Wolfpack Revolution is be is be is because. I'm gonna start a a revol a revol I'm gonna start a revolution, not a war or anything, cause I I don't want to do that stuff. What I'm saying is, the German Wolfpack Revolution means we we talk about certain subjects, conspiracies, supernatural, paranormal. And black, and black Sabbath. I will say this once. I say this again. This is serious, and I take and I take everything seriously. Which I say goes. That sign back there says the man is always right. My way is the German wolf is always right. So, <clears throat> in a few minutes, I'm going to watch Ancient Aliens. I want to talk about that too, also. <clears throat> think, think about this. I said this before. What crashed in 1947 at Roswell, New Mexico? A UFO. The government says... No, it w no, it was a weather balloon. False. It was not a weather balloon. And that's what I'm saying. The government lies to you. Think about it. When you go into a, hold on a minute. If you go into a hotel and you look for the Gideon's Bible. G Guess who puts the Gideon's Bible in the hotels? The government. Look at the pyramid with the CNI on the one dollar bill. The New World Order. That's that is still going on. What you what you see, hear, or read, everything is a conspiracy. Look at. JFK, for example. You don't want to get me started with that. But I can only tell you. I, I, I was not born yet. When this happened. I was, I was non-existent then. This happened in 1963. And. The only thing. Well. I have a movie on it though. Um. Alright. So, one gunshot ran out for JFK. Now, here's a visual aid to help you guys out. Let's pretend I'm JFK. Alright, so I'm in, in, in the car with my wife. Alright, so, it's like the first shot rings out and it goes through here. Back here for JFK. So, one shot... Um, g goes out, and he, he goes down, second shot from, from the, from the grassy knoll, so it'd be like, one, 
two. The final, the final shot was from a manhole. Three. Three shots, a lot of shots ring, ring down. But the thing is, there were so many people there, it was mass confusion. <clears throat> Everything which I said, if you read a book about conspiracies, if you watch something on TV, or anything, I'm not making this up. Everything what you, you hear, hear, it's always a, cons a conspiracy. Like JFK stuff, it's a conspiracy. Because when everything what I know about that stuff, you don't want to get me started. That's why I'm giving you a small example of it. When when he passed away, um, the only thing I said was when he got um, shot, um, it was like, which I said, the shots were coming from all, all over. I mean, one was coming from the Texas Book Depository. Alright, so, let's say that's the Texas Book Depository, and, it, and he, he gets hit from back here, so one goes down, the other shot was coming from the grassy knoll, all right? so nobody can't see who it was, two goes back, the third shot comes from a manhole with somebody in there, which nobody can't see. Three. You see what I'm saying? Everything which I said to you guys is a conspiracy. Aliens, UFOs, Bigfoot, Loch Ness Monster, Demons, Satan, everything. Conspiracy. And I will, and I will expose it. In the in in episode two of the German Wolfpack Revolution. Favorite, like, and share, and subscribe to me if you want to see more content like this. And I'm always serious about it. Now, why don't I talk about it tonight? Uh, and and in three hours from now, I want I want to see progress. I want to see views. I don't want to see zero. I want to see over 3.9k to this video. And I'm serious about it, guys. I really want to talk about it. <clears throat> Hold on for one sec. I'm talking too much. Uh, I need a drink from the Pepsi Max. Anyways, we need to wolf out. Wait, Alpha Beast? Mm, yes, we need to work out tonight. German Wolf Pack. Now we need to rock out, wolf out, and you do not have to be afraid of the Alpha Beast or the German Wolf. Thank you for watching the German Wolf Pack Revolution.